Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Ethereum and Bitcoin daily update. Should we worry about the crash that we had yesterday? Where are we going? What are the next price targets? And now we are going to proceed real quickly into the technical analysis. Thank you for watching the video. Have a fantastic day and I hope you will have if you already do not have a fantastic day wherever you are. And let's proceed real quickly into the technical analysis. Right now we are going to start with Ethereum and we will go to Bitcoin chart as well. Here you can see that we had on the 4 hour frame a very very slightly mini crash. For Ethereum personally, I think that the, this wasn't the crash at all. You can see that we went down minus 3%, minus 1.63% on the 4 hour frame, found support level on the 50 day MA. Now we are already above the 20 day MA. Ethereum didn't, it didn't seem to just care at all, okay? After this mini crash right there. And what are we going to do right now is that we are going to see some important price targets. We can use two tools to identify some price targets, okay? The first one is the Fibonacci retracement. Starting from the top to the bottom because we want to identify major resistance levels, we are going to see the 5k as our first as our next actually target okay 5k tether usd that is and if i wanted to see some more i would draw my fib extension trend based fibonacci extension tool from the bottom right here back on 20 july ending up to this top right there around there okay and here we go around this top as well and you can see that the one line of the fibonacci extension perfectly collides with the 1.236 Fibonacci retracement, okay? And the 1.618 perfectly collides with the 1.786, 6.4K. So we have some major resistance level of the 5K in which we might find some correction right there. And of course, we have at the 6.5K Tether USD as well. So yes, the next price target is the 6.5K, and we are going to see right now what uh, risk do we have on the 4-hour frame. We do not have a huge risk right there. You can see that we have a higher low pattern on the RSI. Commotional index went below the minus 100. We had an oversold situation right here for Ethereum. And the Fisher Transform just had a dive, a nice dive back into the zero in which we are finding a little bit support and now a bullish recross. Let's see if this will keep going. Now we are going to Bitcoin chart. And on Bitcoin chart, we are going to do the same. Okay, we are going to do the same. We have first the 1.236, a minor resistance level at the 73K. And the most important one is the 78k why because if you draw the FIBA extension from this bottom right here there we go around there okay we are perfectly fine i do not want to use the magnet right there because it doesn't matter to be exactly precise every cent to this top and to this bottom okay you can see that we have the 73k the 1.618 is the 789 uh, or 79k if you wish, around 78 to 79 as well, k, okay? So the next major price target for Bitcoin is the 78 to 79k Tether USD. And we have one more, the 10, uh, the 100,000 Tether USD, you can see it is the 2 of the Fibonacci retracement, it is the 2.618 of the trend-based Fibonacci extension, the 100,000 Tether USD and we have the 78 to 79, let's say 80k for Bitcoin as well. So these are the next price targets. Should we worry about Bitcoin's price action right now? We had a little bit of a minor, very, very minor crash right there. I do not know if it is a crash at all, but yes, we had a sudden drop on the uh, Bitcoin and we went down almost like minus 5%. Okay, but at the same time, what we have done is we have made the 50 day MA as support level 
and on the daily frame if you look at it we haven't closed down much minus three percent on the daily frame it is nothing nothing important okay it is less on coinbase i think but anyway it is nothing that we should be scared and say that oh we are going all the way down okay and you can see that we didn't even touch the 20 day ma this is absolutely ridiculous to say that we are bearish or we should be scared or that's it from now on we are going down i've heard those words right there not at all do not worry about that and do not let anyone just for uh the clicks tell you that we are going to get down we are going to have a crash right there okay so anyway before we close the video join the monthly subscription buy me a coffee slash mind your crypto you will find the link in the description down below and in the comment section you will be able to trade 200 altcoins automatically with buying and selling opportunities you will know exactly when to buy and exactly when to sell your altcoins and you will get many educational videos thank you for watching have a fantastic day wherever you are see you soon with many many more videos bye